I really appreciate everyone that has submitted their product descriptions. My original intent was to take the product descriptions that you wrote and use artificial intelligence to tweak the descriptions to make them, you know, a little bit better, a little bit easier to read, and probably in a better format that um, you would want to use in your Etsy store. However, with 11 of you each having a minimum of five products, I simply don't have time to redo product descriptions for everybody. And really, this is something that you need to learn to do as you continue on in, in your Etsy store. So I want to show you how I write product descriptions for my products. And I use artificial intelligence. The Canva platform, I, I know I've created videos in uh, Canva for you guys to watch before. And as you probably have guessed, I use Canva for all different kinds of things. And I think that as an Etsy seller, Canva is a really good tool to invest in because you can edit your product photos in them. You can actually create products within Canva. I have a digital product that I created using Canva that I sell. So there's just so many things that you can do with it that it's just a really good investment. There is a free version available but the free version is going to limit you. So I really encourage you to invest in the pro edition of Canva. Okay, so for writing product descriptions, here's what we're going to do. In Canva, you can just create a new doc, just a plain doc. And to access the AI tool in Canva, you're going to come down and click on Magic Write. The first thing you have to do whenever you're using an AI tool, whether it's the one in Canva or if you're using chat GPT, you have to give the AI tool a command. Okay, so I'm asking it to create an Etsy product title and description in the first person voice using the following facts. And so here's where I just want to start listing attributes of whatever product it is that, I, that I'm trying to create a description for. So there are, you know, the facts, attributes, or whatever of the product. And I have my command. So I'm just going to click Generate. And there you go. You have a... Uh, a title. I think that this title has a lot of great keywords in it and keywords are always important whenever you're writing uh, titles and descriptions of your products in Etsy. So you just want to make sure that you've got really good keywords in there that describe the item as closely as possible so that way the Etsy search engine can pick it up and, and match it to the customer's query. So one thing I want to say about AI, any tool that you use, AI is great. It gives you a really good place to start from to write product descriptions. You do probably need to go in and edit the descriptions a little bit. Number one, make sure that the description is, is explaining the item correctly. And then also making sure that there are no huge bodies of text because when people have a bunch of text that's pushed together, like if this looked like this, that becomes really hard for people to read. So just make sure that all of your text is broken up to make it easier to read and just go through there and read and, you know, just edit it however you see fit. If hello, their beautiful soul is not something that that you would personally say yourself, you can take that out. But the, again, this just really gives you a good starting point for writing the product descriptions. And I hope you find this tip useful. So my challenge to all of you is to go get on Canva. Uh, again, you will have to have the pro subscription, but if you don't, if, if you cannot get the pro subscription, if you can't afford it right now or whatever, just let me know and I'll work with you to either let you access my account or see if I can get a, an account set up that everybody can ha have access to. 
But again, Canva is such a useful tool. I use it all the time for my Etsy store for so many different things that it, it's just a really good investment. So if anyone has any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to me. But now that you should have your product descriptions at least written in some format, like I'm pulling up Bobby's here. So Bobby's got all of her product descriptions. Uh, go ahead and take these and edit them into in the Canva platform and, and see if you can create a little bit better descriptions for your products.